because this is the this is the granddaddy of all cold weather tales. And uh, you're going to get it in its excruciating entirety. <laughs> sun, by the men who moil for gold. The Arctic trails have their secret tales that would make your blood run cold. The northern lights have seen queer sights, but the queerest they ever did see was that night on the marge of Lake LaBarge. I cremated Sam McGee. blooms and blows. Why he left his home in the south to roam round the pole, God only knows. He was always cold, but the land of gold seemed to hold him like a spell, though he'd often say in his homely way that he'd sooner live in hell. On Christmas Day, we were mushing our way along the Dawson Trail, talking your cold. Through the parkas folded, stabbed like a driven nail. If our eyes we closed and the lashes froze so that sometimes we couldn't see. It wasn't much fun. But the only one to whip her was Sam McGee. And that very night, as we lay packed tight in our robes beneath the snow, and the dogs were fed and the stars overhead were dancing heel and toe, he looked at me and, Cap, says he, I'll cash in this trip, I guess, but if I do, I'm asking that you won't refuse my last request. Well, he seemed so low that I couldn't say no, and he says with a sort of moan, It's this cursed cold, and it's not right home till the chills clean through the bone. You take me in dead. It's my awful dread of an icy grave that pains. So I want you to swear that foul or fair, You'll cremate my last remains. Well, a pal's last need is a thing to eat, so I, I swore I would not fail. We started on at the stroke of dawn, but God, he looked ghastly pale. He crouched in the sleigh, and he raved all day of his home in Tennessee. And before nightfall, the corpse was all that was left of Sam McGee. There wasn't a breath in that land of death. And I hurried, horror driven, with a corpse half hit that I couldn't get rid because of a promise given. It was lashed to the slave, but it seemed to say, You may tax your brawn and brains, but you promise true, so it's up to you to cremate these last remains. Now, promise made is a debt unpaid, and the trail has its own stern code. In the days to come, though my lips were dumb, in my heart, how I cursed that load. In the long, long nights, by the lone firelight, while the huskies, round in a ring, howled out their woes to the homeless snows. Oh, God, how I loathed that thing. And every day, that quiet clay seemed to heavy and heavier grow. And on I went, though the dogs were spent, and the grub was getting low. The trail was bad, and I felt half mad, but I swore I would not get in. And I often sing to the hateful thing, and it harmed it with a grin. <laughs> Till I came to the marge of Lake LaBarge, and a derelict there lay. It was jammed in the ice, but I saw on a trice it was called the Alice May. And I looked at it, and I thought of it, and 
and I looked at my frozen chum. Then here, says I, with a sudden cry, is my crematorium. Some pipes I tore from the cabin floor and I lit the boiler fire. Some coal I found that was lying around and I heaped the fuel higher. The furnace roared and the flames just soared. Such a place you seldom see. And I burrowed a hole in the glowing coal and I stuffed in Sam McGee. <laughs> then I made a hike. For I didn't like to hear him sizzle so. <laughs> And the heavens scowled, and the huskies howled, and the winds began to blow. It was icy cold, but the hot sweat rolled down my cheeks, and I don't know why. And the greasy smoke, like an ugly cloak, went streaking down the sky. I do not know how long in the snow I wrestled with grisly fear. But the stars came out and danced about, ever again I ventured near. I was sick with dread, but I bravely said, I'll just take a peep inside. I guess he's cooked. And it's time I looked, and the door I opened wide. <laughs> and there sat Sam, looking cool and calm in the heart of the furnace roar. And he wore a smile, you could see a mile, he said, please, close that door. <laughs> it's fine in here, but I greatly fear you'll let in the cold and storm. Since I left Plum Tree down in Tennessee, it's the first time I've been warm. <laughs> things done in the midnight sun <laughs> by the men who moil for gold. The Arctic trails have their secret tales that would make your blood run cold. The northern lights have seen queer sights, but the queerest they ever did see was that night on the marge of Lake La Barge. I cremated Sam McGee. <laughs> <laughs>